This image gives you an overview in what way Business by Design can be customized and integrated. The blue hexagons represent the Business by Design core application, which is managed and developed by SAP. The yellow elements represent the available extensibility options. In the top right corner, you can see key user extensibility, which was explained in the previous chapter. It offers front-end based modifications with an integrated toolset. Going further down, you see the capabilities to integrate with external applications. On the one hand, we have predefined interfaces that are shipped with every business by design solution. They offer the capabilities to realize business to business communication scenarios, like exchanging business documents with partners or sending electronic invoices to customers. In addition, they can be used to realize the exchange of data between business by design and third party applications. On the other hand, SAP Solutions on Demand Studio offers the possibility of extending the existing communication scenarios or creating entirely new communication scenarios and integration possibilities. But in this session, we want to focus on the application development with SAP Solutions on Demand Studio. Customer specific solutions are built for one specific customer. We call these solutions also one offs because they are usually developed only once for a specific customer. Customer specific solutions allow us to create sophisticated applications that can leverage the underlying business by design system. These are built either in a partner development tenant or directly in the customer's development tenant. Later, those are deployed from the development system into the productive system of the customer. And there they run as native applications in business by design. SAP offers a partner development infrastructure, short PDI for custom development. The partner development infrastructure is a very important concept in the area of SAP's cloud computing. As you can see on the graphic, SAP separates clearly between the by design platform and the development environment. The platform represents the core of the business by design application, which is maintained and under continuous development of SAP. Customers and partners can implement their own solution on top of the business by design platform. The development environment offers comprehensive tools to extend the solution create custom applications, business logic, and other custom components. As you can see in the upper area of the graphic, SAP categorizes different partner extensions. First, we have the mashups here. Those are more front-end oriented solutions that can either be done with the key user tools or with the SDK. As an example, you could imagine a Google map that is linked to the address data of a business partner. This integrated solution will be displayed then in the business partner view. The SDK also provides many functionalities for extending existing forms as well as adapting existing reports. It is also possible to create new content for forms or reports. For example, you can create new data sources based on custom or existing business objects. These can be used later then in an analytic report. But here we want to focus on the development of custom solutions. Custom solutions provide new functionalities in terms of new work centers, new business objects, and additional business logic in order to realize entire business scenarios that are not shipped with business by design. As told before, you have also the possibility of creating new interfaces in order to integrate with external applications. In sum, we can say that the development environment for business by design offers customers and partners the possibility to create simple extensions for the existing system or create complex add-ons that cover more complex business scenarios. Solutions that cover complete business scenarios and touch several business areas of the standard solutions are called micro-vertical solutions. The key objectives of having a partner development infrastructure are the improvement of the backend functionality in order to address more potential customers, and the improvement of the front-end attractiveness in order to address more users at the customer. Now let's take a closer look at the SDK's content. At first, we have the development environment, SAP Solutions On Demand Studio, which is based on Microsoft Visual Studio. This development environment offers all the functionalities that are necessary in order to support the developer in his daily tasks. This includes features like code highlighting, syntax checks, debugging, version control, and many more. In addition to that, the SDK reuses the previous explained key user tools, that combination allows us to create new applications that take advantage of all the additional features of Business by Design, like the extensibility options, analytics, and forms. A very important part of the SDK is the public solution model, short PSM. This model allows us to create custom applications that access the Business by Design core. 
Through the PSM, we can access many of the standard business objects within Business by Design. For example, that would allow us to program an application that selects an employee of the By Design system, query the sales orders he is responsible for, sum up the total values, and display that in our application. This enables us to create highly integrated applications that touch several business processes of Business by Design. The SDK uses many wizards in order to support the developer and to enhance his productivity. A good example would be the creation of screens. Using a wizard, you can generate screens based on your coding and enhance these later in the UI designer, which is an integrated tool for the UI design. Another example is the creation of a web service interface, which also can be generated using a wizard. All you have to do is select the desired business object where you need an interface for, choose the operations like create, update, delete, and finish the wizard. After that, you can directly download the WSDL, which is a description of your service interface. This can then be used to integrate with third-party applications. This is a very easy and efficient way to realize customer-specific integration scenarios. The end-to-end -end software lifecycle management is also included in the SDK. You don't have to care much about deployment or version control. It's all included in the SDK. With a few clicks, you can deploy your solution to the SAP runtime and directly test it there. Also, if you need to get the solution from your development system to the customer's productive system, you will only have to download a zip file from the implementation manager and upload it to the customer system. Yes, it is as simple as that. Also creating patches or new versions for your solution is done with a few clicks and the help of the implementation manager. Finally, you have the possibility of selling your solutions in the SAP store Customers can browse the SAP store, find your solution and directly install it. In case you create an application that is rather customer independent than customer specific, this is a great place to sell it to multiple customers.